Hello. Hello, Mason. Hello, Theo. Hello, everyone. Today, I thought we'd read another dinosaur book, Romp in the Swamp by Ian Wybrow and Adrian Reynolds. Oh, they look happy. Mm. Mum and Nana were taking Sam to see her new school. That's why Harry and the dinosaurs had to go and play with some girl called Charlie. And Harry, Harry called their names, but the dinosaurs were hiding. Mm. They're not under the table. There's Nana, Mum, Sam. Where are the dinosaurs? I see them. They're on top of the table. Don't let Charlie play with us, Harry, said Apatosaurus. She might do bendy on our legs, said Ankyosaurus. She might chew our tails, said Trainosaurus. She won't understand about dinosaurs, said Scalidosaurus. Don't worry, said Harry. You get in the bucket. I won't let anyone play with my dinosaurs. Everyone's feeling a little bit worried about playing in a new house with a new friend. What took you so long, slow coach, said Sam. None of your business, said Harry. Good thing Nana sat between them. Hmm, what are they doing? Look at those little tongues. Hmm, that's not how you talk to your big sister. Charlie and her mum, Charlie and her mum came to the door to meet Harry. Harry hid the dinosaurs behind his back. Goodbye, called mum. Have a good time. Harry and the dinosaurs didn't think that they would. Well, there he is, hiding the dinosaurs behind his back. And there's Mum. Let's see what happens. Charlie went inside and sat on the sofa with her toys. Harry sat at the under, other end of the sofa he guarded his dinosaurs and he wouldn't speak. There's Charlie. And there's Harry. Hmm. Charlie went off and found a big basket. In went some cushions, oh, in went her dump truck and her tractor, in went her cushions, in went some boxes, in went some pans and some plants and some string. That looks interesting. Harry and the dinosaurs followed her into the garden. What's she doing? whispered Harry. What's she doing? whispered Harry. What is she doing? Looks like she's filling up that pan with water. She's making a, pri a primeval a pr forest, said Ankyosaurus, and a primordial, whatever that is, swamp said Triceratops. That looks fun, said Stegosaurus. Went the hose like a great big snake. They look happy, don't they? Hmm, he's thinking, ooh, what's that? Look out! 
shouted Harry. That snake might bite us. Oh no, he's squeezing Trianosaurus. Quick, save him. They're pretending that the hose is a snake. That's a good idea. Quick, save him. What's going to happen? Harry and the dinosaurs joined in the noisy game. Ankyosaurus went crash with the tractor. Scolitosaurus went bump with the dump truck. And Apatosaurus and Triceratops made a strong snake lead out of string. Stegosaurus grabbed the snake's tail. Oh my gosh, look what's happening. There's the snake. <laughs> look, it's got hold of the tail. Oh, look, she's running in the background. And there's the tractor and the dump truck. That looks like a fun game. Help, help me with the snake cage, shouted Charlie. Whomp, went the cage and captured the snake. Rah, said Trainosaurus. You can't catch me, Mr. Snakey. Whomp. <laughs> Look at that dude. Look at him there. Uh, and they look so happy on the tractor. Then everyone did a noisy capture dance. Can you do that? <laughs> you make a noise and then you just put your hand like that. La, 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 la. That sounds like a good thing to do when you're dancing. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Boo. Hooray, said Charlie. What shall we do now? Let's all have a feast, said Harry. Would you like to play with Charlie another day, said Mum. Definitely said Harry. Definitely, said the dinosaurs. <laughs> then it says Endosaurus. What's their feast? What have they got? Looks like cake, milk and chips. Do you like chips? I like chips. There's the chips. Yum. That was a great story. <laughs> Let's look at what this page looks like. And there's the snake. It is a little bit scary sometimes going to a new place and you feel a little bit, little bit nervous, a little bit quiet, but it'll be okay. Now I brought something today since we were reading about dinosaurs that I thought I'd show you. You know, I think you might have seen this, Mason and Theo, but these were once alive and swimming around. And now they're just pressed into the rock. They're fish. They once were fish, but now they're just in the rock. It's called a fossil. And a fossil is was once something... A dinosaur bones or fish uh, and um, they've had lots and lots and lots and lots of they died you've got lots and lots of dirt on top of them and then over millions of years they've turned into rock like this this used to swim in the water but what they've done they've cut it open That's what's inside. Here's some more. I don't even know what they're called. I probably should have found out before I even showed you. Hmm. Here's a little one. If you go to the museum, I think I bought this little one at the museum. So these are rocks now. Hard, hard like a rock. But look how beautiful they are. 
Anyway, I love them. I love fossils. I love dead dinosaurs, not live ones. <laughs> All right, good night. It was nice to, nice to chat to you. Hope you have a fantastic sleep. I love you lots. Bye. Mm-hmm.